Hi guys, it's your girl Natalie, the One True Diamond, coming at you guys with a Dollar Tree haul. Okay, what about Dollar Tree? Now y'all know what I told y'all I was gonna do, right? What did I say I was gonna do? I was gonna pick up a foam board so I could make me a vision board. I did everything but pick up the foam board to make a vision board. I don't know what, I, I just got distracted. I'm telling y'all, Christmas has got me totally distracted. But I'm gonna show y'all this quick little haul. I didn't do too much because I'm like, I had to keep telling myself, look, make sure, see what you got, don't overdo it, don't get carried away, okay? So, yeah, anyway. I'm going to show y'all this because it was out on the counter and I forgot to show it to you guys. This is from a haul from maybe three weeks ago, a month ago, something. I just happened to be at the um, counter and I saw this. This was an ad scene on TV product. It is the three second rapid repair laser bond. And I only seen it in one Dollar Tree. I wasn't really looking for it. I just was checking out, and it was right there at the counter by the register. And it looked like it could be worth a little something. It could do something. So let's... I haven't tried it yet, but it's three-second rapid repair laser bond. It's UV-activated liquid plastic. It works on plastic, metal, rubber, wood, glass, and more. It says repairs and seals tight with UV light. So evidently, this little piece right here is the UV light and push it and that causes the glue to work. It reminded me of like the nails and everything, okay? Okay, it says it fixes, fills, fastens, and seals. Pliable, paintable, remarkable. It includes two replacement battery, excuse me, button cell batteries. And it looks like she's sealing her glasses with it. I'm sure it says repair practically anything. It says plastic, metal, glass, and you know, just, I just got it just to try. Let's see, it says three seconds. Sorry, there's a glare up there. But anyway, it was only a dollar at the Dollar Tree, so you can't go wrong with that, right? Right. Okay. So, let's see what I'm going to start with. I just got my good all-time favorite, and it's just awesome, and it will get a stain out of anything. I know y'all seen this forever in a day, but I got this because I've got some stains in the back of my car on the floor, and I'm going to see if that awesome, that awesome will get that up out of the carpet. So, yeah. And then, of course... I needed some applesauce to go with my lunch. I usually have like a sandwich, like either tuna, chicken, or like some type type of turkey meat, and I'll eat applesauce with it um, for lunch. This I used to get the natural unsweetened, so I'm sure this one here might be a little bit more points than what my other one usually is. The natural unsweetened is usually like um, one point on the points plus let's see since I got my phone here I can try to see if it'll come on up let's see scan so each one of these cups are two points per the pro um, tracker you probably can't see that Oops. can't use it. it won't focus on it it's too Light against light. Anyway, it's two points. Maybe somebody's probably saying we don't care. <laughs> we don't do care. <laughs> and okay, and I got this here. This was so cute. And I thought I'm gonna use it on my vision board some kind of way. And I only bought one. Should have got more because you can always use it's good for crafting later on. It's really to hang pictures on. It's the photo clip and it's called special moments. And it comes with the twine. I hate to show my nails because they look so bad, you guys. I'm sorry. They. I'll be glad when my other girl comes back. And it looks like the way they're talking is like she only plans on coming back part time. So my heart is heavy about that. So we'll see. But anyway, minus y'all don't look at these raggedy nails. But the twine 
And then they each got a little saying. I got to turn it this way. It says, live, laugh, love, dream, believe, and hope. What better inspiration for the little paper clip, the little clothespins? What better thing to inspire on a vision board than that? So, yeah, so I got those. Another thing I got that I thought was so cute, and I'm sure people probably have um, hauled them, but I hadn't seen them myself and not I just thought it was cute I thought about during the holidays you can um, sit these out you can put little snack goodies in for folks who's coming um, by um, can grab a snack I also thought um, if we do decide to have some type of Christmas party we could use it in that decoration is this not cute or what it's a little elf basket it's just one of the little cheap little wicker baskets, but they fixed it up so cute. And then I got the elf, and then they had a Santa, and I got the Santa. And I thought that was just adorable. Cute. So I bought those two. I um, also got these, and I'm waiting for the dishcloths. I know they're going to be there because all the other designs had dishcloths, so I know I probably can find them somewhere. So yeah, so I got this. If this is not the true Christmassy, this just Christmas to me. And it said season greetings, but look at that. Does this remind you of when you were a child with the, we always had a live tree. I've never had a live tree because I don't want to take care of it and the bristles and getting all that stuff up. But anyway, is that not cute? And then I got the pot holders to match. And you get two of those and they have the same thing. So I'm just got to wait it out and hopefully I look in another Dollar Tree. I can find the dishcloths to go with it because I like to drape a dishcloth on my oven door to match my placemats that are hanging off of my cabinet door. So, yeah. So, anyway, got that. Because I told you my theme for my kitchen was going to be a traditional Christmas thing with, you know, the reds, the greens, and all that. These, I did see people hauling these. These are really what I went in to go look for. I want to hang them throughout the house somewhere. And I'm thinking about putting them on each bedroom door um, and my bathroom door down this end of the hallway. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that in or if I'm going to do anything with it. But anyway, this is what this is for. And this says, Tis the Season. Is that not cute? And I thought about maybe hanging it off of my... I have a baker's rack where I have, like, some extra things. I'm thinking about maybe hanging it off of that. Or I could hang it off the doorknob to the pantry. But it seems like that might get in the way. But I picked up this one. And it's made out of this, like not wood but like this hard particle board is what it's made out of but that is so cute to me and I got this one here I thought this one was the cutest Santa Claus is coming to town now this was the cutest one to me I fell in love with this one and I had to have it. I'm not sure where I'm going to put this at, but it's going somewhere, okay? Love it. And then I got, oh, and I, this one was cute too. <laughs> I'm a child at heart, I'm sorry. <laughs> a 50 year old child, I know. And this one says, Have your elf a merry little Christmas. Is that not cute or what? These are some cute signs for a dollar. You can't beat that for a dollar. Um, might have to put some or reinforce this ribbon. I don't know how sturdy that's going to be. And then the last one is this one right here. Uh, I think I might have to put some more twine or something on that one, maybe. But it says Merry Christmas. Is that not cute or what? Little cardinal that's our North Carolina state bird. Love it. Pine cone, pine tree is, no it's not. Maybe it is our state tree. It's been so long since I took this, it's been about fifth grade, okay? 
and then the dogwood tree is our state tree. No, so it's a dogwood tree that's our state tree. Yeah, that's what it is. No, it's not. No, it is not. The dogwood might be Mississippi. I think the pine tree is North Carolina. I don't know. It's a pine cone. You <laughs> see it in the country. <laughs> well, I grew up with pine trees around me, okay? <laughs> anyway, it says Christmas, okay? It is Christmas. So anyway, let's see. I think that's all I got. Yep, that is all I got, my little haul. I did not do too bad. There was a lot of things. Let me tell y'all, there are a lot, 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 lot of nice ornaments. If you want a traditional red, green Christmas tree with like the homemade looking ornaments, there are a lot of things. They had some of the cutest little lantern ornaments. There were some white ones and some black ones. Those were cute. They had like the church house ornament. That was cute. You could really fix your tree up at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. And I'm telling you, if you're so lucky as to wait and they knock things off half price after Christmas, I know somebody might say, well, I need it now. But if you don't, you can buy a few of those pieces after Christmas. They had little, small, tiny nutcrackers. And, oh, my goodness, the flowers for the holiday season are to die for. They have the prettiest berries and the prettiest steak spikes with the pine cones on them. And, um... It was a lot of things in there for the Christmas holidays. So do make sure you go in to the Dollar Tree and look. Don't don't count it short just because it's a Dollar Tree. Because they do have some items in there that are nice that look worthy. It does not look like the little cheapy Dollar Tree stuff. So you just got to take time and hunt and look. And I didn't really have time today to really look, look, look like I wanted to because I... I have to drive so far to get home, so I can't waste too many, too much time in one store. But anyway, you guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little haul. Hope you saw something that you might like and might want to go look for. If not, just enjoy me looking and shopping for the Christmas holiday, okay? I'll talk with you guys later. Y'all have a wonderfully blessed night. Bye now.